asparagus i disagree it is not only a loss for us it is a win for the establishment they proved they are the ones in charge no they didn't no they didn't wikileaks is still up and running right wikileaks still publishing stuff there are other websites other organizations that have popped up where leaks are being released right look at boeing right what's one of the most dangerous jobs in the world right now to be a w w boeing whistleblower because the hitman will come after you but that hasn't stopped whistleblowers from releasing information on boeing right i disagree i disagree big time right it's not a win for humanity have you ever have you ever gotten a ticket from the government that they were wrong to give you the ticket but you still paid the ticket right that's not a win on their part that's a loss on their part because what they just did they made you detest them they made you realize that you cannot trust them right it's like when a liar gets you to do something based on a lie and then you find out that they lied will you trust that person again fuck no right this is this is a sound bite for them they say we won we got a signature rest of humanity that knows what's going on they say no you didn't you losers you didn't get a win you got a big time loss because you wanted to kill him and he lived right you wanted to you wanted to throw him in a pit and lock the door and make sure he wouldn't speak again but he will right they didn't get a win right you should got to think of the long game do the calculus what just happened for 12 years they persecuted julian assange they crucified julian assange for most of those years wikileaks continued to release information right in that 12 years right in that 12 years there are tens upon tens of millions of people that have been rejuvenated that have been awakened to become warriors of truth right i've seen it through my live streams where people go who's julian assange and we tell them they come back maybe not next stream maybe not a week months maybe a year or two later hey chicho i heard about julian assange looked into him holy cow right that's a win that's a win it's like people say that occupy wall street was a failure hell no that's because they didn't know what occupy wall street was obama administration came overnight and annihilated occupy wall street right they attacked them across the united states shut it down did they kill occupy wall street no they didn't they rejuvenated the true warriors they came up with organizations uh, cooperatives plans to decentralize themselves right why do you think there's so much pressure on the fiat currency system why do you think we're in complete free fall in the western world economically right because they've lost complete trust of the people they're supposed to govern because people now know that this government is not working for our best interest right they lifted the veil and that's exactly what they did when they went after Julian Assange or tried to crucify a journalist, they lifted the veil. They revealed who they are. And anyone that was paying attention understood. And they have adjusted their lives accordingly. And those little red rats that thought Julian Assange bad, well, they've slowly, I've seen it in the faces of some of them, they've slowly realized that they were complete morons right they were they were low iq little red rats right and they can't they, they, they'll never be able to live that down right they won't it's brilliant it's brilliant they be a negative nasty or you can do what chicho <laughs> yamadava says you can sit there all day being a negative na nancy or you can do what chicho is saying and look at the long game look at the long game the long game humanity wins right it is such a mighty victory it's a victory 
right? War is not a clean thing. War is dirty. Take the win. Take the win. Right? Take the win. 